Yeah, man. They 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 be coming with the BS. Like it's it's like it's like they, they that's how that's that's they open. That's they come in. They always they always come in to y'all DMs like, yo, I can do this, and yo, if you give it me, it ain't about that though. Like, nah, it ain't about what. Nah, like I said, I'm a woman, man. Ain't no girl, that's for girls. Mm -hmm. When you when you know when you know yourself and you know what it is that you are looking for, and you know that you're not going to settle for anything less. Them lines right there, about what you could do. Shit, I could everything you just said you could do for me. I could do it for myself. So what's the difference? Mm -hmm. Like, what what is the difference? I could take my own self out. I could buy my own self what I want to buy. <laughs> don't like that, man. That still don't save me, man. You want to buy some? Go, go, Lane Bryant. Get them bra when they be seventy, eighty dollars. Now I hate, I hate to go buy them, but I, I know I need them. I'm just saying, you know, I, I mean, you know what I'm saying? I know I need them, so you know I ain't got no choice but to buy them. So you, so you're saying that you, you saying, look, know what you're getting into, huh? You better know what you're getting into. Man, listen. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh man, I'm I, I'm I'm just saying. I, I'm, I'm just yeah, saying because I I am I I am enjoying that video. You like? Yeah, you, you no, ain't no secret over here. Mm -mm. You mean? Right. I mean, you you a man? You you want a woman? It go hard or go home. Either she gonna keep it real, or either she gonna be fake. I mean, which one is? That's all I'm saying. How many motherfuckers is hitting you up though? I don't know. Half the time I don't check that shit. I don't somebody check it if it say um like um when they show you like, like your likes or whatever before mm -hmm. it's the DM. I don't check that because there ain't somebody there. God damn it, man! See this? I told them default. Default. I don't know how to talk. They come at you with, "Hey, yo, what's up?" Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's how all gonna be true. How do you how how do you want them to come? How how do you want like me? I'm like you know like I I think me and you talked about this before when I was saying like when when I I try to like not to talk to social media females because it's like you're trying to you 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 got to swim through all of the nonsense and all of the rhetoric. <laughs> to get to to get to the guy that's trying to get your attention, you sure do now. Now that you do, and I and I, I understand that because of some fact, like I just said, I don't go to my inbox like that because mm -hmm. when you scroll after like, so many times, you see just foolishness. So get it. Let me go back out, and that's what I normally do because I ain't got time for all that. How old are you, first of all? Who me? Yes. Oh, I'm shit. I'm in my fifties. I'm fifty two. Okay, so you're an older guy. Yes. You married? Was married. Was married for about twenty five years. Wow. Yeah. What? Well, yeah. well. Look, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, we, we, we. I, <laughs> I no, no. I'm not gonna bullshit. I initiated, but you know, she did her thing. I did mine. We tried to come back to the table. Um. Okay. So, what are you doing now? Are you dating anybody? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm in the I'm in the dating world. I'm not I'm not dating, you know. I'm okay, a, so when you approach a woman, what's your usual pickup line, shall I say? Oh, you know, beta, you know, I'm 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 a I guess you can call me a normal type guy. Like, you know, I say hello, how you doing? Um, okay. That's fine. Now listen at me. Okay. Hey, how you doing? Like that's fine, that's cool. Mm -hmm. When you first see somebody you're about to speak in a way. Ask right. them how you doing. Right. When I first see you, if I be like, "Hey man, what's up? Uh, I like you. I I find you 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 fine as hell. You gonna think something wrong with me? Are you not? Nah, I I I don't come to you like. Oh, you talking about coming to me? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Because see, I that's, how, that's all I'm saying. Because I'm I, I'm a country woman. Like my grandma raised me. For you to come at me like that, somebody yo, what's up? And you look good. And you don't don't do that. Like that's a turn off. Right. That's because I I think I I think a all lot of conversation and your choice of words de determines people who are I don't want or more into the, have more intelligence than somebody else can I say that mm -hmm. I said so well a, a lot of you know uh, that's you know that's that's I don't I think that's more like the norm for some guys and that's crazy because mm -hmm. a lot of females like you know like how a guy come up to you like hmm 
you know, you look fine in them jeans and this, that, and the third. But I'm, I'm like, you know, she already knows she look good. She already knows she look fine in them jeans. Come a different way. Like, like I said, I, I, I come to you like, hey, how you doing? You know, my name's Sean. You know, uh, what's your name? And once I get your name, then you know, I go, you know, I go from there. You know, but you in the you in the world like I'm in the world. You know, nice guys slash girls finish last. Nobody wants the nice person that's going to talk with common sense and also treat them with common sense. They want the old slang slash thuggish slash bullshit. Yeah, yeah, in so many words. Yeah, like yeah, and I, I don't want to sound like I'm I'm not uppity when I say that, but I'm just saying like mm -mm, I hear you. It's more so as being people just going with this. It's more followers and not enough leaders. So okay, if your homegirl got this dude that's talking to her, you know, you like it, you fine, cause that's the swag. That's his swag. I ain't with that. Mm -mm. No. Well, I'm glad me. Yeah. I'm glad me and you on the same page. How old are you? Ain't, didn't I ask you that before? Let me see. Ah, oh, see, damn, damn it, huh? Damn it! Why you gotta be thirty six? How come you couldn't be like forty nine? Oh no, no! What do you mean? <laughs> because see, see, I, I, I tend to, I, I tend to keep my, my options towards fifty and up. You know what I'm saying? But I'm I'm digging like like you. I mean, if I was to give you a chance, then yeah, I you know I, I I'll fuck with you because I know where you're coming from. You see what I'm saying? But a lot of females like like fifty, well, like forty and younger, it's on that bullshit. You know, they on that they 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 not on that like they they on that. What's that motherfucking song? Let me show you how you love them and dip on nigga. Yeah, that's oh, them. You see, you see that junk what they doing? Yeah. Somebody won't get hurt, man. I'm telling you, man. You even get taking these folk money and playing with their feelings and yeah. stuff. And think you can just dip. Somebody going to dip your ass off in the river. And yeah. Think they were, they were yeah. yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And all these damn songs over here feeling, yeah. these, feeling these female heads up on some bullshit. Like, you but know. See, that, that's because, like I said, ain't nobody no leader. Everybody followers. It's the trend. Everybody worried about what somebody gonna say if they nah. <laughs> yeah, so that. that's why I said. I, that's why I said like fifty and up. They already got you. They already settled. They already set. The kids is already grown. You know what I'm saying? You know, companionship is what I'm looking for. That that companionship. What I'm looking for. Like when I come home. Like, you know, go out to dinner, go out to see a, you know, see a, well, no, we ain't going to see no movie. It's Corona. Uh, you know, probably, <laughs> probably watch a movie and all like that and, and do what grown folks do. You know what I'm saying? And then while I'm out on the road, you know, call up each other. Hey, how you doing? What's going on? You okay out there? Yes, I am. Thank you very much. And all like that. And, and, and that's what's up. That's what I'm looking for. You know what I'm saying? I'm not looking for I'm not looking for a a a a, a kingy a a a a, a clingy female. Uh, when when is you coming back home? Uh, when are you coming? No, don't, I don't need say it like this. That. It's okay to be it's okay to be clingy, but it's not okay to be clingy clingy to the point where you are depending on a person. Right, right. So I ain't gonna say all the way clean. I, I ain't gonna say I could be clinging at times, but I'm not well, clinging to the point where I'm depending on a person. I'd probably be like, well, yeah, damn, babe, I can't wait for you to get home. Like, yeah, when you that, home? No, that's what she, I'm thinking. Now, that but part right there. One day before he come home, she, I'm gonna make it do what it count do. It, like, right, count it down. Like, Damn. That, that part right there, yeah. But I'm not talking about like clink, like like you said, clingy to the point of, of of depending on me. Like, oh, I need my nails done. I need my hair done. I need my lashes done. I need my brows done. Like, yo, don't you got a job? <laughs> oh, so oh, so 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 you you, you don't spoil your women as they say. The I'll, I'll, listen, I'll spoil you. Let me spoil you. That's what I'm saying. Let me spoil. If I want to look, if I want to get you something nice, I'm going to get you something nice because you're my girlfriend. That's what I'll do. Girlfriend, you know? you're 50 years old. Your ass and bypass your girlfriend stayed when you came out of high school, honey. You need a woman. Okay. Well, my woman. Okay. 
Uh, my woman. All right. So my woman, I'll I'll take care of you. I'll I ain't chewing your head off, but I'm just saying. Oh no, you're good. No, that's what's up. That's what's up. No, that's what I'm saying. You know, let me know. You know, let me know. Let me know. Tell to get to school me. That's what's up. Because like I said, okay. this like I said, this dating thing. Boy. So here's the um here's the next thing. Mm -hmm. Since we supposed to talk about social media topics, mm -hmm. what is your idea of dating women with kids? Since I see everybody over here talking about that boy, talking about he, what is your thing when it comes to dating people with kids? Okay. Would you date a woman with kids? Okay, here you go. Here you go. All right, here you go. All right. Now, from experience, I have dated a woman with kids. Uh, the kids was, you know, young, you not know, like that, but I had issues. You know, she didn't, you know, she didn't take, you know, she didn't do what kids needed to be do. Kids need to be in their place. And unfortunately, they wasn't in their place. Like if me and her sitting down watching TV, you know, and all like that. Yo, you know, kid. You know, you got you got an Xbox up. You got an Xbox in your room. Go in, you know, go in and play. Come downstairs. Hi, how you doing, Mister Such and Such? Thank you. Please come again. Okay, don't don't come down here getting in the middle and then arguing with your moms. And I'm sitting here like, you gonna do something about that? And I I, I don't want to be that guy. You know, like. Yo, you don't know, nah, you know, because if I was to be that guy, then the moms would be like, no, you don't talk to my kid that way. Hey, hey, okay. I'm just saying you might want to put a little bit of discipline in them. I'm, 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 I'm just saying, I'm just saying, you know, I ain't going to let, you know, if you want to have your kid disrespect you and all like that, go ahead. All right. Now that's on that part. Now. Now, I just feel, all right, don't, don't get mad at me, all right? I ain't going to get mad. This is your, this is your opinion. All right. Don't well, that's your mad. ideal or whatever you no, want to call it. Get my opinion. Don't, don't get mad at me. But your kid going to have to be grown. He don't have to be out of the house. He don't you have to. Lie. He, if, he, if he's wrong, he need to be. Well, I mean, he, I mean, he don't have to be out of the house. He, he don't have to be necessarily out of the house because you know, you know, during these time, this this time and age, it, it's crazy out there. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's you know, it, it's crazy. So they they don't have to be out of the house, but as long as they respect the mother and all like that, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. But usually it's like if if I was to come over and all mm -hmm. like that, the you know, the son or daughter, they'll 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 probably leave and do something else. They'll probably come in, they'll see us in the living room and all like that, like, yo, mom, I'm out. And then the moms would be like, All right, cool, I'll see you uh see what, a couple of hours, three, four hours? Yeah, yeah, I'll I'll be back soon. All right, cool, bam. And then, you know, me and you, you know what I'm saying? We you know, we cool, chilling, watching some TV, eating some seafood. I don't know, some females can't handle seafood, though. But, you know, I'll probably get you a pizza and I'll eat some seafood, you know, and do grown folks shit, I guess. Mm -hmm. So the answer to that question will be no. Uh, well. Yeah, I guess. I guess you could say that since I went all the way around the world with it. <laughs> right. <laughs> but um, how about how about how about you? How how about how about you? Would you date a guy with with young kids? I mean, yeah. I mean, everybody has their past for a reason, and long as it's a past, it's a past. Mm -hmm. I'm not talking about nothing in the present day. I, I wouldn't, I mean, it don't matter as long as he's taking care of his kids and doing what he's supposed to for the kids, as long as they're not disrespectful. But if I sit here and tell you, hey, your kid and cuss me out, oh, that's just him. Okay, <laughs> one time. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> you say one <laughs> time. One, one time, time. That's it. Right. 
<laughs> because as a, as a man and as a woman, once somebody tell you about your kids being disrespectful towards them and you haven't corrected the problem, then it's gonna be a it, it is gonna be an issue. Mm-hmm. So I don't believe no kid, whether it's the mom or dad or whether it's the girlfriend, the boyfriend, the husband, whatever the case may be, no kid should be disrespectful anyway towards a older person in general. Like I don't give a damn. They go for my son. Exactly. Well, but yeah, I wouldn't with kids because, like I say, I mean. It, it is what it is. Well, I, you know, like I said, I, I don't mind. I mean, it's, I mean, I, I, I don't mind as long as the kid is, is, is respectful, you know. But then again, I guess guys just don't want to be used either. You see what I'm saying? If that How makes they- sense. But then the one with a kid. How are they being used? Well, you know, well, you know, some women. Because you know. if that's the case, it go both ways. A woman is still with a um, man, even if he had kids, and still take care of the kids mm-hmm. because it's a package deal. To me, that's to me now. Everything you come with is a package deal. Everything I come with is a package deal. I don't care if I got 20 children. I don't care if I got one child. Mm-hmm. I don't care if you got 100 children. I don't care if you got one child. It's still a part. That's a part of you. And if somebody does not like a part of you, they don't like you. Mm. If so, if a kid is the issue with somebody, then you only need to be with them anyway, because like I said, that was before their time, and that was nothing that it was like more of a controllable situation. But at the same time, it wasn't a controllable situation. So I mean, the kids didn't ask to be here. Mm. Nobody. And then now, like I say, it's twenty twenty one. If you run across a man or woman that's forty, fifty, sixty years old, unless it was career wise or if something happened, they don't have a child. You better make sure it ain't. They born the way they said they were born. They were born first of all, mm-hmm. cause you got the undercovers out here too. <laughs> I agree. But if I, you know what, I tell you what though, I tell you what. I mean, I guess depending on depending on the age, you know what I'm saying. And if I really, really, truly dig that woman, then yeah, yeah. I would have to, um, I, I would have to date her, you know, this, like you said, this, as long as the kids is respectable and all like that, then I guess I don't have no problem. Like I said, especially if I'm digging her. So, so what about the other part when you say that the man is being used, how is he being used? Like some guys, like, like some guys, like, like some guys being used like how a female would be like, and this is from what I, you know, see on social media, how a female would use her, her, her kid. Like, you know, my kid needs some pampers or my kid need this. And, and if you can't do this for my kid, then, you know, so. Oh, we're not, we're not even talking about them. They, they don't fall in the norm. They don't fall in the, Grown folks, them children still. We ain't talking about them for oh, Okay. Yeah, we talking about just grown people in general and folks that you actually like grown, like grown, grown folks talk. I ain't talking about, I ain't including them in nothing because them right there, I could bash their head in a while. Okay, cool. As long as we on but the same I, page. I'm talking about them solid ones. I'm talking about them solid women and them solid men. The one that actually take care of their responsibility. The ones that's actually providing for their kids and strictly their kids and doing what they're supposed to do. Like your kids come first. Once you have kids, your kid, my theory is my, my child comes before me because that's my child. Mm-hmm. At the end of the day, my child comes before me. I don't care what it is. My child gonna always come before me because that's my child. That's how I look at my kid. My my, Even though my son is like 25 years old, but I still... That child still comes before you. Yeah. So I don't care if he gets 50 years old, that child still gonna come before you. Yeah, he's this dude is my rock right here. So he he's yeah. gonna always be, you know. So, but yeah, I mean, you know, they like I said, the date, the dating thing though is just, it's just crazy. It's just it crazy. is, and nobody is dating with a purpose. Folks just dating just to get whatever they can get. Oh my God! Yes. Ah, uh, and that is so. Uh, oh my God, that that is just so. That's just so bad, right there, too, man. 
I mean, be honest. I mean, if you're gonna, if if, if all you want to do is get your funky on you know, shit, let her know in the beginning and stop wasting the damn time. Uh-uh. They're not because they're gonna be missing out. How they gonna wait? How they gonna be missing out if they come in with false pretense? Because it's something more that they want. They want more than just. They actually want just to have sex. Mm-hmm. I got your I ain't got my headset. My headset, my truck, my truck in the shop. Okay. But they actually want to have sex. But they also want the materialistic things and the financial support as well. But they don't want commitment. Like you're not the one that they're gonna choose. I'm not saying you and general just speaking. Mm-hmm. You're not the one they're gonna choose for that because the one that they actually want don't want them. So now they have to settle for something else. Mm. So the next big thing in line that they know that's gonna keep their nails deep. So all I gotta do is just wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, and that's it. So of course, that's what they're gonna do. But well, you know, it's you you know the, the the females on 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 um the females on on social media. It's like it's like the one guy said. You know, you over here shaking your ass, showing you know, showing off and all like that. Yeah, I'm. I, I agree with him. I, I'm a guy. I like it. I'm gonna watch it. I'm gonna look at it. But <laughs> is that something that's is that something gonna be like? Am I am I am I gonna give you know be one hundred? What you know? Because I don't I don't I don't I don't want you know. Fifty million dudes in your DMs because you over here doing TikTok dances and and Instagram pictures half naked and all like that. I mean, what kind like of said, what kind of guy are you actually looking for if you're doing that? If if you're and people, they showing them the attention, so that's what they're looking for. They're seeking attention. Exactly. Huh. Wow. Oh, no, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you at? Spending our yard over here um, in Minneapolis. Oh, damn. You ain't that far from me. Where you at? I'm in Ohio. Oh, I came to that yesterday. Oh, what shit? Why you didn't? Was you driving on, <laughs> was you driving on Thanksgiving? Yeah. Yeah, I was. I actually, I be at home. For, well, I don't be at home for Christmas, but normally I bring my boy here. But this year, I'm gonna stay at the house. I'm gonna be home for about a week or so, week and a half or so. So, oh. be at home. I Damn. was. Damn, why are you gonna be home for a week? <laughs>